we're talking about some soft baits that I brought along. Now I want to talk about my hard bait selection from the Devil's River. Again, it's I'm lining up with you know the fact that there's a lot of bait fish, uh, and the, you know the research that we looked at earlier it said that you know a lot of belly contents or stomach contents, uh, the fish surveyed uh, had a lot of bait fish. So if we look at my crank bait and hard bait selection here. You know I've got a crank bait selection. It's pretty small. Uh, I start out with some patterns that are fish patterns. So these are fish patterns, uh, bait fish patterns. And I've got some crawfish patterns here. Uh, and then I did bring uh, a really a copper's uh, smallmouth pattern that I'm going to experiment with. I just think in that clear water, the detail of this bait uh, might be a killer. Uh, you know, everybody knows that smallmouth bass, they're cannibalistic. You know, they'll eat each other. And so I'm going to do a little testing with that theory. Uh, and then my top water selection really is going to be uh, poppers, uh, torpedoes are great top water baits. And then I've got walking bait by Waco's Custom Lure that I use a handmade walking bait. We're going to try some night fishing as well from the islands. And so to do some night fishing, I like a slow, steady retrieve bait instead of a you know stop and go kind of bait for top water. And so I brought this jitterbug with me. Uh, and a couple other jitterbugs similar to that. And then this is an oldie, but a good goodie. It's a meadow mouse uh, by Hit Headed. And uh, it's been a really big producer on large, uh, on large mouth bass and uh, big small mouth bass for me over the years. So these will be the things I'm gonna throw off the island tonight. Uh, but that's pretty much my hard bait selection. Uh, again, it's based on you know the the, uh, the, the number of bait fish um, you know that are in that river uh, available for food for the fish, and hopefully uh, you know I pick something right here. We'll see, never been there, uh, didn't research, and this is what I came up with. Uh, we'll see how it pans out when we get on the river.